Hello guys, Tiger Airport here, and um, <clears throat> I like to show you my uh robot collection so far. Um, you know, but anyways, we'll start off with the bottom. Um, here's some of my robots. I got three robot leaders in the back and three um astrobots. There's my uh, robot ninja right there and. My Autotron and the other one behind it, the blue version. And so we'll start down here. My little robotic zombie. And here's my <clears throat> my robotic um, techno in the back right here. Well, in the front. And then here is my Optimus Prime. My robotic Yoda. Bumblebee. Um, some kind of robot book here. I can't figure out what's on. Um, uh, Clank, or Clank, or whatever you want to call him. Robot 2001, just, um, mini version. Um, just have to or so. I'm trying to repair him. And so we'll start, uh, and then we'll right here is my Zerg. And, uh, up here. And my, <clears throat> my, uh, Lost from Space, Robbie the Robot, uh, Darth Vader Alarm Clock, Extreme Fighter, Happy Kid Toys, um, G.I. Joe Accelerator Soup Duke, uh, <clears throat> Cosmos Defender, Wowie Zombie Robot, and of course, um, the two new remote control robots, um, I forgot what, I forgot what these were called, but, um, Elite Robo right there, some Transformer in the back, <clears throat> Robocop Robot by, uh, Soma Toys, uh, Power Z Robot, uh, Space Wiser Robot, King Titan, Turbo Fighter, Another Autotron. There's a Cosmic. Robot 2001. Millennium. All three in a row. Um, one of the Robo Squad uh, mini series of the Mars robots. Um, Heavy Swordsman robot. Well, I think. Uh, um,. No, that's, um, that's, a uh, Heavy Cannon Robot. Robot Commander Zadok. Um, a Mini Cosmic Robot. Happy Kid Toys Firefighter Robot, first generation. Happy Kid Toys, uh, Policeman Robot, first generation. Oh. And over here... Got a Star Screen, Power Ranger, uh, Power Ranger Transformer Robot, another uh, Mini Cosmic, uh, <clears throat> some uh, Power Ranger, another Power Ranger Transformer, another uh, Transformer in the back, some uh, some kind of robot. I can't don't know what that one is. And then in the back we got um. I forgot the name of that robot, but it's, I think it's named, like, I can't remember, but I know he's, he's a remote-controlled, um, Robo-Attack is his name, Robo-Attack Robot, that's his name. Okay, so up here, uh, got, uh, <clears throat> Sonic TV, Bump and Go Robot, by Hokei Toys, Magic Mike, uh, Little dancing robot, uh, Space Wiser, no, no Space Berserker, the Chinese version, uh, Adventure Force, new model of the uh, dinosaur robot, the original version, and Super Fighter, and that's pretty much, that's pretty much all I got as far as my robot collection. Oh yeah, and I forgot down here. I got the uh, Power Rangers um, Exosaur robot, 
and uh, Bumblebee helmet. Got the Power Rangers large robot. And then uh, Grimlock. And uh, I got two little, little laser guns right there. Yeah. But yeah, that's my robot collection. And since I'm already showing y'all guys all this stuff, I might as well go ahead and go over here. These are the boxes that I've got. Uh, <clears throat> that's uh, um uh, my Jimmy Hip Swing and Santa Claus, but he's he's in the closet. That's why he's not in the box. But I'm gonna put him in the box soon. And um, I got the Wizard of Oz, Wicked Witch of the West by Jimmy, the smaller version. Millennium Robot. That's his box that it come that it came in. And I got Voice Bot right here. Voice Bot. He's in the box, so you know, yeah. And then uh, Robot 2001, which is he's he's up there on the up there on the shelf. And uh, Sonic TV's box. And uh, and uh, so now here's my horror movie collection right here. I'm not gonna go through and tie the whole thing because there's so many of them. And then. Here's all my game consoles, right here, and then up here, I got like a little Jason Machete hanging down, got a uh, craft made haunted house that I got from a Halloween convention, and then here is a Jason Voorhees with Pennywise, the, the mini Jim, uh, Jimmy Freddy Krueger, I'll show you him real quick. I think he's pretty bad looking. He's really cool. I got him for my, I got him for my birthday from my grandparents. But anyways, you know. Yeah, the motor gets stuck sometimes. He's in, yeah, he's, yeah, he's, yeah, I gotta fix him. I'm gonna split you in two. Never play skin the cat. <laughs> Come to Freddy. Welcome to my nightmare. <laughs> Tell him Freddy sent you. Yes. <laughs> Yeah, he's he's old. I think he came out like 2005. I got him for like 50 bucks off of eBay, which is not really that bad, really. I have to say, for a Freddy Krueger um action figure or something like this, yeah, it wouldn't be that bad, you know. For 50 dollars, no. There was another one that was um I was going to get the Jason Voorhees too for Christmas, but you know, I thought you know me and my me and my grandparents we thought. It's just too much money to put in both of them, you know, because they were both like fifty nine something dollars. Yeah, so um, uh, here's um Chucky the um complete seven movie collection, um special edition, really cool. And here's one of here's uh my Jason Voorhees uh collect co uh collection collection edition action figure right there. He's really 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 cool. And then we got Nightmare on Elm Street 2, Freddy's Revenge. The Man of Your Dreams is back. Um, <clears throat> here's an action figure of him. Oh, yeah, and I forgot to show you the artwork on the back of the door. The lid or whatever. Oh, my gosh, it's freaking bad, man. It is it is cool. I like the art design they put on the back of the cover, which is really, really cool. Yeah, these has never been ever taken out of the box, and they never will be, so, you know, I'm planning on collecting them, you know, because, you know, number one, you know, I want to keep them kind of worth something, because these are, these are famous movie actors, and 
part two is that if I ever do, if I if I do take them out, some pieces are just going to get lost, and I don't want that to happen. You know, I want to keep everything all together and stuff. So you know, that's why I'm just going to leave them in the box and keep them that way. There's Jason's picture behind the cover. Really, really cool. I love it. And then <clears throat> we got Hellraiser right here. Got him for like um, at, at, at the horror convention too, along with the uh, haunted house. It lights up and stuff. Um, but anyways, the pinhead doll, the pinhead action figure. He's really cool. He was originally sold for uh, ninety bucks. Uh, <clears throat> but um, they took fifty off of it, so. A pretty good deal so yeah um and here um it's made by um uh, um sika or whatever the, that's the company's name and then here's his weapons right there hanging off his his suit or whatever he wears sadly he's missing the box that goes in his hand that's probably why they agreed to lower the price down you know and he's holding a some kind of some kind of hook knife is what it looks like, I think. But anyways, on the back, has a switch and a, and there's a speaker in the battery compartment. I'll turn them around and I'll show you the detail. Right, he's really, really cool. For 50 bucks, I think it was kind of worth it, especially for a collectible. He has a sensor that, yeah. <clears throat> yes, as long as I hold the light on him. I don't really turn him off. He'll just go on and on and on and on and on. And uh, the reason that is because as long as you hold the light on him on the sensor, sensor's um, right there. And um, as long, I mean. It's got a sensor that activ that activates him, and as long as you hold the light on him, he'll just keep on and on and on saying stuff. He'll just, you know, he's really, really, really cool, and I love it, you know, especially for fifty dollars. It was worth the price. But yeah, that's my room. That's everything. Really, really cool. Um. Oh yeah, I did forget to mention. One more thing is that <clears throat> these are my uh, arcade machines, my my uh, uh, one of my arcade machines, my pinball machine, and then here is my Scooby Doo pinball machine right there. Really, really cool. And I have to say, I got a pretty nice robot collection. Go ahead and detail it to you. There you have it. It's my robot collection. Oh yeah, I f also yeah. Sorry about that, but I forgot to mention. I got a, uh, the Robo Safian behind uh, the Space Berserker. By the way, yeah, I got a uh, uh, Robo Safian. Ro robot Safian by Wowie. Wowie Toys. Now, um, the Cosmic Robot was made by a uh, Fingy One. And uh, you know, he uh, he was a he came out by a uh, Fingy one. Same with Robot Berserker, he came out by Fingy one as well. And uh, he came out by Happy Kid Toys, the Fireman and the Policeman also. Robot two thousand one, Son AI Toys or Son AI or Son AI Toys, whatever you want to call it. Millennium was by Pull Effect Toys. And um and I think he came from uh, Mega Cannon. I think he came from, uh, he came from Soma Toys, I believe. And, uh, he came from Wowie. 
Uh, now, Cosmos Defender came out from Cool Toys. He came out by Hasbro, the G.I. Joe guy. He came from Happy Kid. I think he came out by Fingy One as well. King Titan, Happy Kid Toys. Turbo Fighter, Happy Kid Toys. Autotron, Happy Kid Toys. Uh, Space Wiser in the back. By, made by uh, Fingy One, I'm sure. Um, Techno. Uh, I can't remember what company that came from. No, the zombie, I definitely cannot figure out what company it came from. Sony Eye Toys, I know that for sure. The um, Mini Robot 2001. And by the way, just to let y'all know, I was putting them on my shelf. Here's the story of how he broke. I was putting them on my shelf. And I was on my stepladder putting them on the top shelf. Well, you know what? I accidentally dropped them. He slipped out of my hand and he fell. And when he hit the floor, it just shattered it. It broke the bottom and the top of the torso. I was so, like, pissed. I was like, ugh. I was pissed, man. Like, ugh, it made me mad. But, yeah. So now I got half of a torso of it now. But, I'm, I mean, I'm surprised that he still lights up and still talks and works and stuff. You know, I don't know how I'm going to fix it, though. I might just have to throw that one away and get a whole other new one. Because I saw one on eBay for, I, I forgot how much it was. But I might purchase it before long. Now, the Zerg was made by uh, Thinkaway Toys, you know. A lot of the Disney toys came from Thinkaway, you know. And here is Mini Cosmic. Uh, I think the, uh, yeah, I think this one came, I think these two, these two Cosmic Robots. Yep, these two Cosmic Robots right here, I think, came from Bolay Toys. There's a sword that, that goes to a uh, Mega Cannon Robot. <laughs> Robo Scott, Robo Squad mini series of the uh, robots from Mars. The mini Mars series come out by Happy Kid. Happy Kid Toys. Um, and the uh, Starscream, I can't remember. That one I can't remember. All these robots, I can't remember which company they came from. Oh, except the two cosmic robots. I know that. The two mini ones. <laughs> so, um, um, so up here, um, the Sonic TV came out by Hokai Toys, the Sonic TV robot, um, now, uh, Magic Mike came out by New Bright, uh, Space Berserker, Fingy One, that little dancing robot, I can't, I can't remember, I thought I did, but I couldn't remember.